Hey everyone, so I am back with the April nail box. I'm actually a bit behind because I had to take a bit of hiatus from filming. So I actually have to get caught up on the April, May, and June. And then I'm waiting for this month's nail boxy to be shipped out to me. So I'm just going to share this one with you. As you know, this is a monthly subscription box. And each month you get something different. And you get to try different things. So if you'd like to see more in regards to this, stay tuned. Let's take a look at what's inside. So this month is more like nail tools than nail art items which I can appreciate as well because I'm always buying files and buffers so I really really can appreciate this box so we're gonna go through each of the items so this month's product is from a brand in Russia called Stelex I hope I said that correctly so this is a professional brand and this month we got eight items so I'll go ahead and we'll start taking a look at each um, each of the items individually I'll be sharing with you from the April box is the disposable Patman files. So these are files that you can actually put onto like a metal base and you basically will like slip it onto the file and then you could just take it off and dispose of them. So you get 50 in the pack and this is the 180 grit. So as you can see it comes like this and then you would basically slip the metal base into here slide it onto your file and then you would just use it shape file whatever and then take it off throw it in the trash so it comes with 50 of these and i really like these i haven't had a file where you can actually take off the grits like these so i'm really excited to try these as well so this is the metal base that i was talking about i like how it comes packaged this is so neat so this is the base where you would slip one of these onto so I'm just gonna open it here and it even comes with a file in the back as well so then as I was saying you would just slip it on just like so and then your file is ready to go and then of course you would just buff 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 whatever whatever and then when you finish slide it back off I'm not doing that right now because my hands have like cuticle oil on it so it's slippery and then change it to whatever one you want so these are really neat and easy to use so these are really neat and interesting so I can't wait to see like how I like these type of disposable ones compared to like these files that I use all the time and it's been a while since I've showed you guys my nails so yes this is my most current set for those of you that like to see because I haven't been filming I haven't gotten to do this for a while but yes my daughter actually picked these colors so I was really pleased because I could not for the life of me figure out what color I want to go with this like corally peachy color and she picked the purple and ended up working really nicely so next included is another metal base this one is for like your buffers and this one is the expert 55 <music> as you can see obviously this one is a smaller one it's actually really cute and because it's so small it feels weird me holding it like this but of course compared to the longer file you can obviously tell that like clearly two different lengths so next we have the cuticle pusher and honestly guys I love cuticle pushers I love like tools like these in general and I'm always purchasing them because you can never have too many especially when they start to go dull and stuff at least you always have a backup so this cuticle pusher this one is rounded so you can really like get into the grooves and nooks and crannies 
and then it has the scraper here at the end and obviously with the scraper like you could remove any dead skin but again you don't want to be like scraping rough it's just a light gentle kind of push around and it helps to remove any of like the cuticle in after you've pushed and scraped away whatever needed to be and he, inside here is like a little scoop too so these ones I also like to use like for the sugaring because you can scoop it up and then when you're doing like the sugaring nail or you can use it to sprinkle it on the nail so I really like the ones that have the scoop if I don't have my little scooper handy so here next we have the refill buffer pads so in this one you get the 240 grit So this is the 240 grit buffer here it looks like you have compared to this one where you have to stick it in the hole here to slide it the metal base on this one looks like it has a sticky background so it looks like I just have to peel this off and adhere it to the file so there's the adhesive that I was talking about and then basically I would just stick it onto my file and then I've got my own little buffer and then you use it buff whatever and then once you're done you just unstick it but I'm not gonna take it off obviously because I just stuck it on but I like this though and it's super small and cute and I think there's there's a bit in the package like so there are a few refills and again these are like single use only so once you use it on one client you would just dispose of it so next i got some cuticle nippers so these ones are the half jar ones again nicely packaged Ooh, i like that these ones came with like a cover for the tip of the cuticle nippers because honestly these things are ridiculously sharp i've like stuck myself with one of these before so when i'm not using it i would just put the cap on like so so that way obviously i can't hurt anybody i like the feel of these in my hand and then you can always unhook this but when you're using it it's just best to leave it like there because it gives you like a good bounce back but yeah stainless steel and it's got the company name engraved right here if it would show there we go so it's got the name engraved right in there if i could find my other ones but yes i have quite a few nippers so i'm glad to have this to my collection but i really really appreciate this because sometimes if i have them up like this or I might be doing something and forget that it's open I've actually like just hit my finger on it and it really hurts and since these ones are new and obviously have not been used the tip is extremely sharp so you always have to be really careful when using these on clients and even on yourself and you've also got a case for the nippers as well which is really neat you could just stick them in like that and it's even more protected from you damaging the tip because dropping them or even using them to pick off crystals can really make them dull as well. But once I have a nipper that I've used so much that it's become so dull, I just refer to use it as um, once to help take off any crystals on my fingers or on clients' fingers. But I really like this case. It's like leather too. This is really, really nice. And last but not least, I have some file refills. So they're a hundred in a roll i believe yep so there are 100 refill files in this roll and this one is a 240 grip so these ones are basically like these but the 240 grit and then obviously it has the adhesive at the back so i would just measure it to the to the length of the file and then cut off what i need remove the adhesive and stick it onto the file and use it so this is really good because that means like i will have some 240 grit files for a while let me just see if i can get that to go back in since i don't want to waste it because i don't need to use it right now so yes i have these black 50 refills and then i have these ones as well so there are quite a bit of <laughs> refills for my files here so i'll have quite a bit of the 240 
and the 180 for a while plus i have my like other files that i've already purchased as well so i think i'm good on files for now. so here we have it for the end of the april nail boxy so let me know what you guys think of this one i know this one doesn't have like the nail art stuff that you're accustomed to seeing but honestly guys i really appreciate this box because these are things that nail technicians usually buy and use a lot and we're always constantly purchasing these things to making sure that we always have them in stock so i personally can really appreciate this box do you think this is something that you would try if you were to get this box do you think it would help you to maybe maintain your nails more for those of you that don't really maintain your nails as well as you would like as always guys i have everything linked down in the description box below make sure to give this video a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel as well as turn on that notification bell so you will be notified when i do post some more content as always guys thank you so much for sticking with me and stay glamorous